شهرازد Shahrazad. I did ask them to photos that from here on, but they photos that a lot more. If you like to learn um, about prayer, I've got a got a flick to buy the damage at the place. But have a look at this, and if you like this, we can change any time we can change that. A long time ago. A 
dog in is not used. You probably have them in, in Malay, something like that too, don't you? In, uh, in the Malay literature, what do you say? In olden times. Result that's an adjective. So you want E and T. That's B E and T. You understand the difference? E and T is general. You can use it for everything. But A and T you can only use it as a noun. Who is a dependent? A dependent is someone who relies on another person for financial support. You're a dependent. You're a dependent. Your wives are dependent. So a dependent is someone who relies on someone, the husband, the father, for financial support, for the money. Okay. This one now. You don't do it. You let only two sons. One in the prime of manhood and the other let a youth. While both were nuts and braves, uh, but the elder, oh, yeah. the elder was a dotier. Dotier. Oh. Um, that was, okay. Okay. That's all 
Oh, it must be. Then the young boy. Just send one sentence, but there's too much to aim with the prayer. He left only two sons, one in the prime of manhood. Prime, what does the prime mean? Prime is old Latin, old Latin, it's still used. It's not old English, no, it's still current. Prime of life means the time of greatest vigor and uh, success. When you're prime of life, you're 20, 30, 40, that's it. Like I'm not in my prime of life, I'm past that. Prime of life means you're 25, 30, 35, 40. Prime of life? Classes nine. 
gold or plastic mouth. Albeit is English, you can use that word. When that now becomes one word. When you make it in one word, you take off one of the L's. All be it. All, all, everything. Be, no, no, you're going. It, be it. All be it. One word, return <coughs> three words. All be it. The pronunciation is all or the pronunciation is all or not having. the elder, the elder of the two is an elder and a younger. So the elder was a succeeded to the to the empire when he ruled the empire yes, ruled when he ruled and then and afforded it to his his needs legions needs just needs all the all the legions all the legions 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 just is so exemplary that he was beloved by all the people of his capital and of his kingdom. The capital ministry, the capital city, basically, Kuala Lumpur, or Canberra, Australia. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Succeeded. Had double C, double E. Double, double C, double E. Uh, and most of the adjectives, nouns, adverbs uh, are spelled with two C's and two E's. Succeeded as a verb, past tense. Um, adjective, adverb, the nouns all have double C, double E. Mm. The only, it's Latin, it's Latin. Succeed means it's, it's a Latin word coming from achieve. Uh, it succeeded, he achieved, he aimed. Uh, <coughs> he achieved his aim, he achieved his purpose. Um, double S, <coughs> D, double E. 
And uh, most of the other ones, the adjectives, the adverbs, uh, the other English words, have double C, double E. But there is uh, a hidden double C, double F, double L. Yeah, it's an adverb, not not uh, succeed as a verb. Double E. 